First brought to you the story of EKU student Candace Jenkins last August. The Letcher County native lost everything in the Eastern Kentucky flooding. But with the help of her university, she was able to stay in school. And tonight, WKYT's Jeremy Toms caught up with Candace to see how her family is doing and to learn how she is helping others rebuild. That's our top story at 10. Nearly a year has passed. I'm just still waiting like, to wake up because <laughs> it's still, I mean, like this entire year was a complete blur. But Candace Jenkins has spent that year grappling with what happened. I moved into college as quick as I could. I was like, I have to like take a break because it was, it was, it was hard on me. Like it was really, really hard. Candace's Letcher County home was a total loss after the flooding, but she says it is being rebuilt through the Appalachian Service Project. And with EKU funding her education, the rising junior continues to pursue a piece of family history. I'm the first woman to ever go to college in my family. After everything that's happened, my family and the school, they still put my education first. Now she's giving back to her crestfallen community, working as a case manager for the Cajun Navy. I'll go in, I'll contact people, ask them what they're needing with the flood, like what they need to be done to get back on their feet. Candace helps connect other flood victims with the nonprofit's ground crew to start rebuilding. She sees every day that the needs of this region remain great. I was like, we need drywall, flooring, any type of thing that will help. We have no one that can work on like plumbing or HVAC. I mean, the homes is backed up for three years now. With the one year marker upon her, Candace takes solace in the way Kentuckians continually meet those needs for one another. You know, there's kids that never even picked up a shovel before that was out here mucking out people's houses. So I really want people to look back on it and just be very proud of how much we've overcame, how people came together. Jeremy Toms, WKYT. Tough times can make, make people tough. Candace says that her new home should be rebuilt by the end of this year. Right now she's working toward a degree in EKU's brand new manufacturing engineering program. And post-graduation, she hopes to either start her career or join the military.